Hi everyone, this is Carlos with the Emacs Science Support Team, here with another tutorial for y'all. Today we're looking at Selmeg, a Python package for Celestial Mechanics. You can click on the About link, that will take you here. After you have installed it, you can go to a first example, where it gives us this example that we will go through together. So in this example, we are going to use Selmeg in conjunction with Rebound and Body Integrator, which is also available on Emac, to build and integrate a simple Hamiltonian model for the dynamics of a pair of planets in mean motion resonance. So let's go over here. First we will run this cell. This has everything that we need for Rebound and Selmec. If you do not have it, you can simply use um, pip install to install it. Next thing we're going to do, we will initialize a rebound simulation containing a pair of Earth mass planets orbiting a central solar mass star with a 3 to 2 period ratio. So we will initialize rebound with this rb.simulation. Here we add our star, and here we add our two planets. Boom. And then we go ahead and plot it. And this is what we should get back. So the next thing we need to do is this. So we'd like to construct a Hamiltonian that can capture the dynamical evolution of the system. So to start, we'll initialize a Poincaré object in order to represent our system and a Poincaré Hamiltonian here object to model its dynamical evolution. So these objects can be initialized directly from the rebound simulation that we created above. So here we will do that. We set these variables equal to point care dot from simulation sim and then p ham equal to point care Hamiltonian p vars. Great. Now if you want to see the math behind everything, you can use this fam dot h. And then down here what we have done is when a Poincaré Hamiltonian is first initialized, it will only contain the Keplerian terms of the Hamiltonian and will not contain any term representing gravitational interactions between the planets. So in order to explore more interesting dynamics, we need to add terms to the Hamiltonian that will capture pieces of the gravitational interactions between the planets. And so to do that, we can simply use this add.mmr terms, add our numbers. Now our math will come back slightly different. And then here is the fun part. So now we will integrate because we have our Hamiltonian model. And we'll integrate it and compare the results to the rebound and body results. So first, we'll set up some preliminary Python dictionaries and arrays to hold the results of both integrations. So here we define the terms, the times at which we'll get simulation outputs. And now 150 is the time. These are our key quantities that we'll keep track of in rebound and submic integrations. These will be the dictionaries that hold our results here. And then these are the list of particles in both simulations for which we'll save our quantities, rb underscore particles and cm underscore particles. And then here, this loop, this is the main integration loop where we'll integrate our system and store our results. Okay, now let's actually plot. Oops, I want that to be a surprise. So first we will compute the resonance angles for both of our results. Then we will create a figure here, make it pretty, and finally, these are our results. So as you can see, not too bad at all. The Selmec model produces the liberation amplitudes and frequencies observed in the rebound and body results quite successfully. So that was a quick intro to Selmec. There is tons and tons of tutorials, as you can see here. Feel free to give it a try, and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you. Peace.